Hey everyone! So, I'm going to be sharing with you a little bit about my sewing plans. I don't know when these plans are going to come into fruition. I just know I have them and I'm really excited. Like, I bought the fabric, I bought the notions, um, I bought samples before I got these fabrics. Like, it's serious. So, full disclosure, like, as far as, like, buying fabric these days, I don't do much of that. However, the fabric that I do buy, it's always online. And I was never that person because I always felt like it was really scary to buy online. However, I have, like I mentioned, I have become a person that I'm actually taking my time. I actually get samples first. <laughs> so I'm very, at the end of the day, I'm very happy with, with what, I've, what I've gotten. So I make actually a lot of my purchases now from Mood. I just feel like they have a lot of high quality fabric. Um, again, they can be on the more expensive side, but I feel like I'm worth it. <laughs> so for the fall, I'm gonna be showing you three knits and one woven. All right, so first up is this beautiful cotton twill. Um, it is, I think it has just a little bit of uh, spandex on it because it has a little stretch on the crosswise grain, but I just thought it was beautiful, uh, a beautiful neutral, kind of like a, I feel like a, a khaki for like a darker skin tone, <laughs> um, but it, it is it is lightweight um, and I'm going to be using this fabric for the Sew House 7 Burnside bib pattern, which I think will look beautiful. Um, on the website, it kind of made it sound like this would be perfect for like trousers and uh, things like that for like the summertime, but I think it could, I think it's definitely a color that can just kind of cross all seasons and because that is such a kind of relaxed um, pattern, I think, I think it's going to be great. So this is three yards of it um, and it was priced at $7.99 a yard. Okay, so the next two I'll be showing you together since they will be both, uh, they'll both be applied to the same pattern. Um, I'll just show you the pattern. The pattern is the Kamatia, I hope that's how to say it, bodysuit. It's actually a, a turtleneck bodysuit, um, which so I actually plan to put that underneath the Burnside bibs. I think it would be really nice. So, um, one is a, this is a French terry. Um, spandex um, it was $19.99 a yard so it was a bit on the pricier side but it feels so good <laughs> and you're just gonna have to trust me on this because it is black I you know I there's only so much that my iPhone camera will be able to pick up but you know trust me that um, you know it's a beautiful four-way stretch um, and it's of course got the the you know backside loops the loops that are you know on all all Terry's but it's a, a little thinner um, but it just feels so nice and I would expect it to for twenty dollars a yard <laughs> but it um, it is sixty six percent bamboo twenty percent cotton and six percent spandex so I expect this to feel like heaven and I think this will be I can't wait to wear this one personally, even though it's basic black, like this is something special. Um, and my next one that will be in the same pattern is this beautiful, it's uh, got this like orange rust and uh, navy, and this is a rib knit. Um, I don't really know what it means quite, I'm gonna have to look it up, the nine by one rib knit. Um, if anybody understands that, you could just go ahead and <laughs> comment down below exactly what that means and I don't yeah I don't know if it's like nine ribs per something anyway it is a 95% cotton 5% spandex uh, mix so it's it's a little thin but it's it's got like a, a, a nice medium weight to it um, but I just thought the color was beautiful this is the only pattern um, sorry fabric that I didn't get a um, sample for first. I was I, I usually whenever I look for patterns um, I usually like go on Instagram and I actually happen to see somebody with this on and I was like you know what if they're using it, it for their application and I think they use it for the True Bias Nico top which is close to this Kamat Kamatia 
a turtleneck bodysuit pattern. So I forgot to mention the the black fringe terry only got one yard. I think this pattern only only takes one yard, and I'm hoping after I wash these things and shrinking won't be a problem. <laughs> um, but I'll, I'll make it work. And then this one actually got two yards because I actually was going to use the Nico top true bias pattern. And I think for her turtleneck, I think it requires a little over a yard. I think it's like a, a yard and a third or something. But I think I'm just going to use um, this Komatia pattern. So I have another Komatia pattern that's like a, like a V-neck um, t-shirt. So I actually may use the other yard for that. So not exactly sure yet, but I really, really love this rust color. Um, yeah, I forgot to mention that the, the rust and dark navy blue uh, stripe fabric was priced at $13.99 per yard. And last but certainly not least is this beautiful forest green um, Ponte knit. Uh, which is four-way stretch, which I think all Ponte knit is four-way stretch, but it's just so luxurious. Um, this was also an, a sample that I had, um, before I purchased this, I, I purchased a sample of, but I originally wanted um, a Charmeuse color, but they were sold out by the time I got to it, but they had about 10 other colors available and I was so happy with the sample. I figured that it didn't matter what color I got that I would be really happy with it and I, I am. But I, for any fall function, this is like, to me this is like the epitome of Christmas green. And the first thing I do with any sample or any fabric is I immediately put it up to myself because I just want to see, you know, how it looks obviously with my skin tone. So this fabric will be used for the Sew Over It Heather Dress. Um, version 1 or version A, I believe, which is the one that is not color blocked, so it will be solid. And it will be the one with um, full sleeves. So I think it's going to look really nice. Um, and it's kind of like a, I could say like I guess a medium weight, but it feels kind of heavy to me. I mean, this is uh, two yards and it's definitely heftier than all the other ones I got, but I just cannot stop touching it. It just feels so nice. The contents are 62% rayon, 32% nylon, and 6% spandex. So everything I decided to purchase, I really wanted to kind of, unless it's a glitzy glam type of material, like a, I don't know, like a velvet or something, I really kind of wanted to stay away from the the polyesters and just kind of go with more natural fibers that just felt that I knew would just felt really good across the skin and not um, scratchy so so yeah that's it so it's like basically one dress um, one kind of jumpsuit pattern and two um, turtleneck bodysuits which I have no idea how I'm gonna feel about <laughs> the bodysuit thing even though they have snaps at least they have snaps so I'm not um, struggling when I have to use a ladies room thank you so much for watching um, definitely can't wait to see you on the next one and happy sewing